Hello everybody, Crew here, back again once again, and wow, back again once again, and hello, it's been a really long time, it's been a long time since I did some Splatoon 3 content, so, we are going to be bringing back a fan favorite, oh not a fan favorite, but I'm going to be bringing back one of my fa uh, favorite series that I did a long time ago called the How Good Am I series, now, I did do the how good am i series a long time ago back in splatoon 2's you know like heyday so there is that and you know we're bringing it back now it did take a while for me to actually you know do that because a lot of things happened grand festival happened and i was incredibly tired didn't feel like doing it again so uh the grand festival took a lot out of me which the grand festival was fantastic so but we have got an episode now so we're gonna be pulling up the stats here so i did a poll on youtube about which weapon people wanted me to you know see how good i would am with here and the polls are right here and it seems like stringers won by a landslide <laughs> so not a lot of people wanted to see me do a roller all right so but other than that that's going to be what we're going to be using today we're going to be using a stringer out of the stringer class so when it comes to stringers, stringers, they're like snipers, right? They are, they're like snipers, only they take a little bit more skill than what they, you know, now imply. Now, my skill when it comes to stringers is terrible. <laughs> the most time that I have into a stringer is most likely probably these two, this one. Yeah, it's, it's mostly this one. And I put a little bit into the wellspring too, because, you know, I actually like the wellspring. But for the sake of the video, we are going to be using the regular stringer. Yes, we're going to be using the regular stringer. So the regular stringer has Toxic Mist and Killer Whale. Okay. Um, but for that, we're going to be doing it. And f at the end of the video, I'm going to you know, put up all my what's the names. I'm going to put up my kill count, my kill ratio, and all that kind of stuff. And we are going to go in here and we're going to you know, play these games. And I'm going to try to do the best that I can to talk and commentate for you all. Uh, but, you know, it is. I'm going to try. You know, I can get caught up in the game for once. So what we're going to do, we're going to do like most likely two or three, most likely two battles and Anarchy Open because I don't want to play series. <laughs> so uh, we can win a lot. We can lose a lot. Uh, we can win some, lose some. It all depends on how it is at the time. Oh, yeah. I forgot to show off the build that I'm going to be using. So, last thing at least, I'm going to be using this build. Because I'm going to be using Respawn Punisher. So, Respawn Punisher is kind of a funny perk. <laughs> to me, it's funny. I really like it. Uh, punishing people. But I got to try not to get punished myself. That's why the quick jump comes in. So, I can, you know, get away from certain situations. And I'll be able to do that with Toxic Mist. But, uh, yeah. We're, we're, we're gonna do it again. So, I'm gonna start up these games, and I shall see you guys when we actually get a game. Okay, so we are here for game number one. We are gonna be playing Rainmaker. So, my main objective right now is try to protect my team, but it's gonna be a little tough because we have three backline weapons. Uh, one of them can be very aggressive while the other ones can be, you know, one, one smiling can be aggressive while one has to just sit back. So my whole purpose is to protect my team as best as I possibly can. But also, I got to be make sure I'm safe as well. And I didn't do a very good job because my last name is still dead. All right, I got that guy, but there's no way I can stop them from, you know, they already got the first one. And I have to be careful about this guy. All right. Uh, okay, there's that. They're gonna take this, so there's not really much we can do. The best I can do is just kind of like... They're right underneath us right now, so... Um... I'm gonna I'm gonna try to protect that guy. That's the, the best I can do. But also keeping myself safe. Uh... It's gonna be kind of rough. It's gonna be kind of rough. Okay, we actually managed to break it. Oh, that guy's just sitting up there. I want to pick it up, but it's probably best if I don't. All right, that guy's that guy's smart. He took it over there. 
Uh, that was the smartest thing he could ever do. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm actually jumping back because I'm not I'm not safe. One of our Westerners has splashdown, so there's also that. Um, we didn't get it far enough. The thing about this map is, sure, we have like spaces and all that kind of stuff, but there's not really much that I can do. The best thing I can do is just probably like play backline. And we have so much backline, <laughs> so it's also that. We got three down, so we just need to carry it over there. This guy, all right, I got him, I got him, I got him, I got him, I got him. We're advancing, we're advancing, sad. We're advancing, barely, but we're advancing. Uh-oh, I need to back up. Uh, I, need, I need to pop this. Oh, uh, we just need to advance it just a little bit. I'll hold on to it. I'll hold on to it. Oh, somebody's right down here. All right, just move it, just, just advance it, just advance it. We just needed to get closer, that's all. That's all, that's all we literally need to do. <laughs> It was very close. So now all we have to do is just play defense. Defense for two minutes. I don't see how that's going to happen, but we're going to do it the best we can. We're definitely going to do the best we can. All right. I just need to make sure I throw down Toxic Mist. That's the main point about this. Uh, that's the most thing, bang, main thing. Blech, I can't speak words. That's the most main protective thing about... Oh, I got somebody. Nice. I got one person. Uh, uh, I couldn't stop him. Alright, let's do this. Alright, I got one person. We can just break it. We can advance it further. There we go. I want to hold on to it. Even though I, sh even though I technically should it. Um, somebody's behind us? Yeah, I thought so. It's the roller. Thank you. I'm dead. <laughs> Oh, I got respawn punish. That hurts. That really hurts. Oh, that hurts so badly. Oh, boy. Okay, my whole team is dead. That's not good. Um, best thing I can do? Play defense. I, I gotta play back line. I literally have to play back line. Alright, got that guy. There's somebody down here by me. There's somebody down here by me. I know it is. Oh, no. All right, all right, all right. My team is dead. The best thing I can do is just stop them from getting this. That's literally the best I can do. I got that guy. They're gonna go below. Oh, uh, that 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 uh, dread ring is gonna be a problem. Yeah, that dread ring is that dread ring is literally the biggest problem. All right, let's get that guy. Stop it. Get away from us. Uh, I'm literally doing the best I can. Oh, the roller. Hey, the roller has ninja squid. That roller. He's most likely still over there. Yep, he still got it. Alright. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, uh, we just have to defend. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Alright. I just have to protect that guy. I'm going to toss some Toxic Mist while he moves forward. He doesn't need to move forward, but he's, he's moving forward anyway. Oh, no. Can we break it? Okay, cool. We got two. We got one of them because of that. I, I gotta throw Toxic Mist at the Rainmaker. If I throw Toxic Mist, they, can, they won't be able to pick it up. Oh, no. Okay. Alright. Just defend. Defend, defend, defend. Alright. Throw Toxic Mist. Come on. Come on. Yes! Woo! The Wipeout. <laughs> that was tough to do. That was really tough to do. Sorry about the microphone peek there. My complete apologies. Oh boy, that was that was rough. <laughs> but we did it. We did it. We we did protect the what's the name. I played to my strengths, which is being a backline and being a stringer. So it is what it is. That's how it's supposed to be. Alrighty then. Uh as you can see, I got 18 spots because I did do really well. I back I did backed up. So I mean, it is what it is. But I'm going to go ahead and get to the other game, and I shall see you guys in a little bit. Okay, hi everybody. We are back for the second game, and we're going to be playing on Barnacle and Dine. we got to play Rainmaker again. So, um, we have 
two back lines and two oh see no we got a sniper that's a problem now there is a there is a squeezer but a squeezer is now nerfed but it's still so much still a strong weapon so it's still whoa hold on and binocle and dying is a really small stage so we have to be like extremely careful as like i'm dead no i'm not dead i should be but i'm gonna jump backwards yep 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 this is why i have to be careful all right barnacle and nine is a small stage so having weapons like ours is actually a big problem they you can get aggress you can get aggressively pushed hard here and very very rightfully so uh oh Oh, they got me around the once in here. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, see, Squeezer is still a strong weapon. So, it looks like, unfortunately, this is going to be a wash. Yeah. Yeah, that was a that was a wash. There's really not much we can do there. Um, it's a small stage. And having two backline weapons the way we did... It, it wasn't good. <laughs> we, it was awful. So, I mean, it is what it is. But, uh, yeah, that's how it goes sometimes. It'd be like that. So, I uh, shall so see you guys in the lobby. Alrighty then. So, that'll be it for these games. Um, as you can see here, I'm going to be pulling up both of the pictures over here. Over here on my, over here on my left. As you can see in the first game, we did pretty good. And over here on my right, well... We did awful. <laughs> so, when it comes to my, when it comes to how good am I when using the stringer, mm, I would say probably below average. I'm not that really good with uh, stringers. I have some fundamentals with the stringer because the stringer is like somewhat similar to a sniper class, but um, and I play a decent amount of sniper, but so, but I, I, I like, I like the stringer. I like the stringer as it is. I think it's an awesome weapon and I think it should need to be, um, I, you got, you got to respect them sometimes when they're on the field, but, but well, that's it. That's, that's it for this video. Um, I hope you guys all enjoy it. Um, I will be putting up, make sure to make sure to comment below what class you want me what class you want me to use next i will also make a poll on youtube to make sure to uh, decide what everybody wants me to use next but other than that um also i forgot to mention when it comes to the how good am i series i think i'm only gonna make it 10 episodes long because i i'm gonna be completely honest i'm not really the biggest like you know i'm not really the biggest youtuber there is <laughs> so um I, I feel like i'm literally just like in a below i mean i'm not well known youtuber guy so it is there's that so i don't make i don't want to make a series go on for too long if nobody's going to be watching it so it's only going to be 10 episodes long so i want so make sure to comment in the what's name below about what class you want me about what class you want me to use next and see how good I am I'll make a I'll make a poll as well to make sure it if nobody leaves a comment then I will make a poll and whatever votes I get is what weapon I'm going to be using next look at this jelly dude just photobombing everything <laughs> but uh other than that yeah that's all I'm gonna do for you guys Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video and you like what you see, please consider subscribing to the channel and also, um, you know, leave a like on the videos and enjoy some of my other Splatoon content that I have. And it's good to be back with the How Good Am I series. But that's all, everybody. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Till next time, peace.